Most people think there are two types of event in Apex, the collection event and the milestone event. But it turns out there's a secret third one that Respawn only tried several times and then never released again because the events were too generous in giving stuff away. These events started in season 10, which is the season Seer released, with the Monsters Within event. This event was pretty hyped because it was a Halloween event and when we looked at the blog for the event which showed us all the details of it, Respawn revealed some interesting things. First of all, this event wasn't a collection event. Instead, there were going to be a ton of items that can only be obtained through packs which cost 400 Apex coins, which was a pretty good deal. But then again, in this event there were 40 items and a lot of them were kind of useless. Respawn also revealed all of the items from the Monster Within packs will be available in standard event packs after the event ends, which is pretty strange and was a first. As well as being in packs after the event ends, Respawn also revealed that you will be able to craft every single item that was released in this event after the event ends as well. And on top of that, two seasons after the event ends, all of the prices of crafting these items will be halved. And you know what? This event was pretty solid. You could directly purchase any of the skins you wanted to with crafting materials. And also, there was no FOMO, fear of missing out, because all of the items in this event would appear in your skin list ready to be crafted after this event ends. The reception towards the Monsters Within event after it ended was pretty solid, and people did like the idea that all of the items were obtainable no matter if the event was on or off. Respawn then released another thematic event in Season 11 called the Dark Depths event. This one didn't innovate much upon the original Monsters Within formula, and we didn't get any innovation until a season later, when Respawn released the Unshackled thematic event. This time, it got a user interface upgrade and looked a lot more attractive. Also, can we just appreciate how beautiful the user interface for Season 12 was? But eventually, one season later, Respawn will finally figure out the thematic event formula, and oh my god, it was beautiful. As in season 13, we got the Gaiden event, and it wasn't only just a really cool thematic event which was very accessible to any players, but it was also upgraded since the Unshackled event, and now if you bought every single item in the Gaiden event, you would get the Bangalore Prestige skin as the final reward completely for free, which was an awesome upgrade, and it made this Prestige skin really cheap if you had a lot of crafting saved up. You see, a lot of the 40 items in this event were blue items, which were extremely cheap to craft. Craft. Meaning, if you crafted a load of blue items and a few purple items, you then only had to buy a few cheap event packs for 400 coins each, and then you would get the prestige skin, which was pretty solid and really useful to the people who have been saving up crafting for absolutely ages. Also, side note, this Octane skin here originally looked like this until Respawn had to give him a blue hat to, I assume, avoid copyright issues because this skin was inspired by Luffy from One Piece. But unfortunately, this was our last thematic event ever. Finally, when Respawn had perfected the concept of a thematic event, they just stopped releasing them. Why did they do this? Well, I assume it was because people who wanted to buy something from the thematic event would either wait till the item becomes cheaper two seasons later, or buy it with crafting straight up. I don't think many people were buying the Apex packs for 400 Apex coins a pop, which basically made these events not very profitable. There is a conspiracy theory that Respawn made thematic events to drain the whole player base of the crafting material, so they would earn more money in the long run, but that's a dumb conspiracy, honestly. I think Respawn just stopped these events because they didn't make much money. So rest in peace thematic events, you've unfortunately been replaced with something much, much worse.